Raven Elise TV. So my room is extremely messy right now, so I thought it would be the perfect time to get like a before view. As you can see, my drawers are all open, there's stuff all over the floor, different projects going on, laundry that needs to be put away, and just an overall mess going on. My coat is on my bed. I have a big box of clothes that really do not have anywhere that they can go right now besides that box, because as you can see, this is my garment rack and it is completely full and there's even clothes on the floor and this is my desk. Really jacked up, lots of clutter, needs to be organized, needs to be handled. And as you can see, there's my shoe hanging that I did a video on if you wanna see how to do this DIY shoe storage. And then we have my closet which has mirrored sliding doors and then we have me this is supposed to be my jewelry area but it looks really jacked up right now and i went to ihop today for free pancakes so i have my drink so if i stand over here by my desk you can kind of get an overview of my junky messy room so I brought a lot of the things you see in my room here from my dorm room that I was living in freshman year of college. And the theme of my dorm room was hot pink and zebra print. So that's why I have a lot of hot pink stuff because I used to be really into hot pink, but I'm not really into hot pink anymore. And so I tried to kind of incorporate more of the teal color and more gold because I really love gold and I really love the turquoise mint green colors, but I'm not really feeling the hot pink at all anymore I think it makes my room look kind of young and kind of too young so I think I'm gonna basically take all the hot pink stuff and basically spray paint it gold usually when people have garment racks in their room it looks really chic really stylish and it just looks so awesome but mine just looks like a cluttered mess part of the reason is because it's so chock full of clothes like I literally cannot fit a single new hanger on here and also because I tried to create a double layer garment rack by using the lower broken piece of my previous garment rack so if you can see that it's actually not connected to this one it's just a whole nother thing and I did that because I thought you know I want to double up my hanging space so I stuck that underneath there so if you can see that it's just like a whole nother one just kind of stacked in there and that's kind Kind of ratchet and it just adds like so much clutter by having the clothes overlapping and it's just really hard to even see my clothes and when I try to get something it's just like so inconvenient and then it doesn't even hold everything so I just have clothes like on the floor underneath it which looks really ratchet as well so the first thing that I'm gonna do to spruce up my room a little bit is spray paint all of the hot pink stuff gold this includes my picture frames, my desk lamp, and my office chair. Spray paint is really cheap, so this is a great way to spruce up your room at a low cost. And it can really make a big difference. My second affordable DIY project is hanging up a curtain. I got this curtain for $5 from the dollar store, and I'm using a shoestring to hang it up. I live in a rented apartment, so I didn't want to hang a curtain rod and make huge holes in the wall. Nailing a shoestring was the perfect solution. I'm a fashion design major, so I have a lot of spools of thread. To organize them, I put nails in the wall. I cleaned up my room, now it's time for the big reveal.
we just came from the Merch no. Inc. Model meeting thingy to see who's gonna be styling us. <laughs>